Welcome students. Now next question is in air filter, glass wool is used as a dust filter. To filter acid and acidic solution, which of the following is used? Again, glass wool is used to filter acid and acidic solution. In paint, which of the following is used as thinner? Toluene is one of the thinner and other examples are benzene, turpentine and kerosene. In a paint, role of thinner is to increase viscosity. Among the natural thermal insulator, the lowest thermal conductivity material is paper. Other examples are wool, wood, these are the lower, uh, lowest thermal conductivity material. Resin, it is also known as polymer. Then opacity and desired color to paint are provided by pigment. A good thermal insulating material should possess low thermal conductivity. Oleoresinous varnish dry by solvent evaporation followed by oxidation. Glass wool and thermocol are used as insulator in refrigerator. They combine use as insulator. Select thermosetting synthetic adhesive from the following. Thermosetting is bakelite which is also known as phenol formaldehyde. A solution of resin in alcohol it is example of spirit varnish. Alcohol that means uh, it is spirit. A good lubricant should possess high oiliness. The temperature at which oil ceases to flow on a machinery part it is known as pour point. Ceases or it get freeze. It is known as pour point. The temperature at which cloudy appearance of oil it is known as cloud point. The lowest temperature at which oil begins to give enough vapors which give momentary flash of light it is known as flash point. The lowest temperature at which oil catch fire and burn for 5 seconds then it is known as fire point. In spirit varnish small amount of plasticizer is added to avoid brittleness of film, tendency to peel off, tendency to crack the film. The next is formaldehyde it is used as a monomer in the preparation of bakelite which is also known as phenol formaldehyde. Another constituent used as monomer is phenol. Then choose from the following option which is not constituent of paint. Alcohol is not constituent of paint. Constituent of paint are pigment, then vehicle, thinner, dryer, filler, plasticizer and anti-skinning agent. An example of plasticizer in paint is triphenyl phosphate, tributyl phosphate. Then epoxy resin, it is obtained from two monomers. First monomer is bisphenol A and second is epichlorohydrine. These are two monomers which are used in the formation of epoxy resin. An example of anti-skinning agent is polyhydroxyphenol. Due to this, peeling of paint does not occur. An example of dryer is naphthenates of cobalt, lead, etc. Then next is an example of extender of filler in paint is a tag, then calcium carbonate, asbestos, sand. These are used as extenders of fillers in paint which reduce the cost of paint. An example of vehicle is linseed oil, soybean oil, castor oil. Water is also used as vehicle in paint. A chemical added in small amount to paint to reduce a paint defect, it is known as additive. Name the adhesive which is used for making belt and conveyor. Shellac resin which is natural resin, it is used for making belts and conveyors. The type of lubricant used for scissor is liquid. Generally, hazelnut oil is used. Then match the following pair. Use of different polymers. Bakelite, it is used in switchboards and TV cabinets. Then polythene for packaging bags. PVC, that is polyvinyl chloride, it is used in helmets and pipes. Teflon, it is used in gaskets and cookware. Polystyrene for food packing and epoxy resin it is used in aircraft. Which of the following are semi-solid lubricant? Greases, Vaseline and Wax. These are the semi-solid lubricant. Which of the following is solid lubricant? Graphite, molybdenum sulphide. These are the solid lubricant. 
which lubricant are used in high pressure during metal cutting semi solid lubricant that means grease wax they are used at high pressure during metal cutting when a load is high too high and temperature is low which type of lubricants are used solid lubricants are used when the friction is very high which lubricant is used liquid lubricants are used when friction is high which lubricant is used for gears which are subjected to high pressure thick mineral oils with metallic soaps are used for gears with high pressure for steam turbines solid lubricants are used then for cutting tools like sewing uh, sawing then uh, turning boring drilling liquid lubricants are used low viscosity liquids are used when high speed and light load like watches clocks sewing machine or delicate instruments then low viscosity liquids are used like thin oils high viscosity liquids are used when heavy load and slow speed like tractors concrete mixture rail track joints etc thick oils are used a good lubricant should have sufficient oiliness a good lubricant should have high flash point and fire point so that it does not catch fire easily a good lubricant should have high cloud and pour point a good lubricant have high volatility a good lubricant have moderate saponification value then next is uh, a good lubricant is that which does not form any emulsion emulsion that means mixture of oil and water if it is formed it should break easily or quickly the next is oxygen carrier catalyst of paint they are known as what they are known as dryers film forming constituent of paint it is the vehicle or medium oil or water they are used as vehicle or medium in paint example of oil varnish is copal varnish example of spirit varnish is shellac resin in alcohol then example of organic thermal insulator is wool cotton paper thermocol then sawdust these are the example of organic thermal insulator then example of inorganic thermal insulator are glass wool asbestos then organic thermal insulator they are suitable up to 150 degrees celsius then inorganic thermal insulator they are suitable more than 150 degrees celsius for lathe machine water it is used as uh, lubricant then synthetic oils these are what they are chemically prepared compounds these are the mcqs important for pet to from chapter 2 and 3 of basic chemistry course code is 2102 thank you